Hey guys, so today I wanted to show you guys how to order your boxes on Baxter's online service. When you call Baxter and you tell them that you would like this option, they start sending you messages. Like right here, I have a message from yesterday and these ones are from, I think, last week. I mean last month. So they send you messages a week before with the link and the pin number so the pin number changes every time you order it's not going to be the same see like this pin is 1149 but this one is 4033 so every month is going to be a whole different number so i'm going to click it and it's going to be 4033 continue it's gonna welcome you please complete your order in just five steps it's really easy after you understand it because the first time I tried to do this I was very confused <clears throat> gonna press continue right here it's giving you the option to not get anything so if I click this by checking this box you indicate that you do not need any solutions which obviously I do need solutions but let's say you ordered way too many the month before and you have enough to last another month then you should be able to do that but I need my bags so the ultra bag is for manuals so ultra bag ultra bag ultra bag ultra bag these four the first four are going to be for manuals and it does tell you how many items per box so you can put how many boxes you have you don't have to count how many bags you have which is good and then you get down here i need um boxes for my machine so i do use the purple one i use one box a night so right here it says usage bags, I put one box. <clears throat> and in on hand boxes, I have three. So it says that it's gonna order five boxes for me. So I don't use yellow, I do use green 2.5 percent instead of 1.5 percent and i have 20 on hand boxes actually and i use two bags a night so i'm gonna get 26 boxes <clears throat> i don't use the red boxes but again if you guys need these boxes for any reason just add I don't need any of these. On hand, I do keep a couple of the manuals for 2.5% also, just in case something happens, you know, I have extras. Um, if you do have to do a manual through the day, because I know some people have that prescribed by their doctor, then obviously you would have to do this section as well. Um, so this part is done. I already did all the boxes I need for this month. So I will click continue. So this part is all the extra stuff. So the flexi caps, which is the caps that let you disconnect while you're on the machine for any reason. I have enough, so I'm not going to put any. Uh, mini caps, you have they give you i believe oh it says 60 right here 60 per box so one box should last you two months but for some if for some reason you're disconnecting yourself with using the flexi cap obviously this is gonna finish before the two months um so i don't need those i still have a whole box in my closet and I still have my current box which is completely full and then the Amia PD cassette um, I think with that you're always gonna need it you're always gonna need to add one 
Um, the only reason you're going to um, not add one is if you currently have two boxes as you're ordering. So ultra clamps are the red clamps that you use during um, when you're doing manuals. And it's always good to have a good amount of these because you do have to wash them every time you use them. So I do have currently a box of them just in case because I know I don't do manuals but sometimes it's necessary to use the clamps for certain um, for certain dialysis needs. And I'll probably show you guys later how I use the clamps for my current machine. You usually won't need to reorder these unless for some reason you're throwing them away instead of washing them. So there's that. And then the face masks. So they come in packs of 10 and you're supposed to use one per night. So I'm going to order three boxes. So it's one per day. And then I'm going to click continue. So right there, right here, it's going to, um, it's going to make sure you still have the same address. It's not going to show the whole thing and I'm not going to show you guys, obviously. <laughs> But it also asks you, has your delivery address changed? And that's where you would put, if you moved somewhere, um, that's where you would change it. So since my, my um, address hasn't changed, I'm going to click continue. And then it just shows you like everything you're ordering. So it shows the purple bags and the green bags and how many boxes I'm going to be getting and the total quantity. And then if I go scroll down, it shows everything else I got, the PD cassettes and the face mask. So this is just a summary. So it's good to look at it just to make sure that you didn't miss anything. And then it tells you the estimated delivery date. It's going to be on the 23rd. So now I'm just going to place my order. And you go to the end screen thank you for completing your request and that's it that's the whole process of putting your delivery online now um in order to do this online delivery you would still have to call the baxter number their number is right there 1-800-284-4060 and when you talk to the person that's supposed to put the delivery for you you just simply ask them can i order my boxes online and they will send you they will send you the code and the link and they'll ask you to sign in with them the first time and i believe when they do that they do show you how to do it but they didn't show me now that i'm remembering because the first time I tried to use it, I I ordered the wrong purple box. The pur Ugh. I ordered the wrong purple bags. I ordered the manual bags instead of the machine bags. So I I was able to use the manual bags for the machine, and I will show you guys how to do that in a different video. So it wasn't a total <laughs> loss. Also, after you do your order, they do send you a message saying your stock has been submitted and you can still review the products, but I don't think you can change the order after the six days have passed. As you can see, I have seven days left right here. So I think after the seven days that you can't change your order because after that, they will charge you for that order. And one time I was late on putting my order and they were trying to charge me almost $400 for my order and that's a lot considering you know most of us only receive social security money which isn't a lot it's just enough to get by so adding $300 to that would really put a dent into my savings so make sure you guys put your order in online um, on time and sometimes if you don't put it on time, your clinic may have boxes on hand that you can pick up, but um, it's always better to, ha to have your order ready and have your own boxes so you don't have to, you know, impose on anybody. <laughs> I hope this video was able to help you guys. Um, 
I wish there was a video out there when I was first doing it <laughs> because I it really just seemed really confusing to me but it's not um so if you guys liked this video please give it a thumbs up if you guys have any um questions about this video or if you have any requests for another video leave that in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys here next week on tuesday for tuesday tips bye